Look at this! Right, we've got two! And that one there has an enormous amount of fusiliers! They're using the sandpaper-like skin of the shark to rub their own bodies on to remove parasites from their skin. The bull shark has all of the senses you'd expect from a predatory shark. They have the ability to pick up electrical signals from the moving muscles of their prey and also to sense vibration. They can glide along with just the lazy movement of their tail. But don't be fooled by that. They can put on explosive bursts of pace when they're hunting. Bull sharks are real opportunists, eating a massive array of food. Most of the time that's fish, but they will feed on other sharks, mammals, birds at the surface, and even turtles. Just heading along the bottom towards us is a loggerhead turtle. Look at the size of its head. Right now, I have to say, I wouldn't want to be this turtle, surrounded by animals that could well want to try and eat you. It's a very, very beautiful creature. They do need to breathe air, so we'll have to return to the surface at some point. At which point it's going to become very, very vulnerable. Isn't it wonderful? As the sun sets above us, the shark's body language begins to change. Their movements are less languid and lazy, more mean and menacing. There must be 10 or 15 of them around us at the moment, all circling us with real intent. Look at these three. Such dramatic animals. There's something about them now that's truly chilling. The nose is down, they seem twitchy, poised, ready to explode. I'm not so worried about the sharks I can see, it's the ones I can't. This is genuinely one of those moments when you wish you had eyes in the back of your head. I keep spinning around and catching something in the edge of my view and it's a shark and they're coming right in behind you, like that. Wow, they are some of the most menacing of all sharks. It feels like it might be time to head for the surface. It is kind of incredible that we can be swimming in these seas surrounded by bull sharks. And just a few minutes in that direction, there are tourists splashing around happily on the beaches just goes to show that these animals are actually really, really acutely aware of everything in their environment. They know we're not food. Otherwise, you wouldn't stand a chance down here. <laughs> 